Good morning, brothers and sisters, believers, those that are aspiring to be believers. Um, this word, if you're watching, is definitely for you. And we thank God as I pray, I'm, I'm, I'm about to, to pray um, that the right persons will really come in and see what the Lord is actually saying through me, through Angela, you know, and I thank God for a brand new day. It's the 25th. Now we have a lot of five to deal with this morning because of what the Lord has placed upon my heart. You know, he has placed, it's the 25th of 2020, the eighth month, and also the scripture, it, it is... It, the the scripture the name of the prophet it's five letters in it and it's just since i'm i'm about to come on i actually see all of that because god want to show his grace this this day and with um whichever day you have come in contact with this video you know god want to show you his grace and that you are important to him and he loves you unconditionally and so the prophet the prophet has name has five letters and the scripture that the lord has shown me because i wanted to do something else but the lord has shown me a scripture and it has five verses and this morning i really want to read it read those five verses and and I and I and I and I'm just believing God for something. The topic this morning is the love, the undying love of your, the undying love, the undying love of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the undying love of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And I have felt that love many times. This is why I am still here as a believer, a woman that a woman of god you know and just pressing on each day i'm not telling you that i have always have that push it's only through him that i continue to press on as i go on daily and that love that undying love this morning and even though i'm not gonna be here for very long because i know how it goes with the long um with the long um videos in 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 these kind of time that we are living in so i'm just gonna say a few seconds of prayer because I, I want to say a prayer for our unbelievers and for our believers this morning about where the love of our heavenly father is concerned father we give you thanks this morning for your presence we give you thanks for your grace we give you thanks for your mercy we give you thanks for your love this morning your undying love oh god you love us unconditionally and this morning we just want to thank you for your presence thank you for our brothers and sisters that are out there those that are thinking oh god almighty those that are wondering who is this jesus christ i pray that the hearts will be open this morning those that are backslidden mighty god we pray for them this morning and we pray oh god that you will saturate them and just lift them up this morning to know that you love them unconditionally and you will never leave them or forsaken them father we thank you this morning cover this video under your blood under your blood cover your people under your blood this morning those that this video will reach mighty god may you touch them and father god because it's not by power by might it is by your holy spirit and you're the one that is leading this morning you're the one that is guiding and we thank you lord for your coverage in the mighty name of jesus christ of nazareth amen so um even as we have that i'm just gonna go forward and and read the scripture it, it is Hosea, 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 and yes, five letters in Hosea, and that's what I, I'm talking about this one, and the scripture is Hosea 3, and it carries five verses, and it's just when I'm, I'm coming in and sitting down, I'm really seeing all of this, because God is deliberate, God is deliberate, just say deliberate. 
your heavenly father is delivered and he loves you unconditionally so he says then said the lord unto me so you know that the lord is talking to Hosea this morning go yet love a woman beloved of her friend yet an adulteress according to the love of the lord towards the children of israel and remember that part according he's talking to Hosea, and he said according to the love of the lord towards the children of israel who look to other gods and love flagons of wine love flagons of wine and this morning when you look at that verse 2 says so i bought her to me for 15 pieces of silver and for an omer of barley and a, a half omer of barley verse 3 and i said unto her thou shall abide for me many days thou shall not play 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 the all that and those shall not be for for an other man those shall not play the all at and those shall not be for another man so you see Hosea is going after gomer right now he's buying her back he's taking her back he's bringing her in and if you read from one you please you have the time read verse one you go ahead and you read verse one and you see what um Hosea is all about and god is, god is the god that loves to use analogy so even as the, i'm not always gonna be right here you know sometimes a word just pop into my spirit and i just go at it you know just like with the the, the flower I will be seeing other things and I'm just going to go at it and I'm just going to bring it in. And I pray God, I pray to, I pray that the Lord will continue to cover this channel, channel for it to grow as he wants it to grow. Verse four said, for the children of Israel shall abide many days without a king. That's, that don't look good we need a king we need the king but what we need this morning is jesus christ of nazareth that king yes lord thank you jesus and without a prince and without a sacrifice and without an image and without an ephod and without a tamar tam tamarfin 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 yeah um verse 5 says afterward shall the children of israel return and seek the lord their god and david their king and shall fear the lord and his goodness in the latter days hey, hey. yes so the lord is expounding on and his love he he's using an analogy of a man that his wife would gone away and and doing all sort of thing out there and then you would end up um he'd end up speak to him speak to his heart give him that undying love in his heart for this woman that have gone and played the harlot and and that's how we do many times we come to god and then we gone out and we're gone we we, we we leave god we leave the presence of god and it's not only about leaving church it's about leaving the presence of god and you're not seeking him anymore you're not praying anymore you're not fasting anymore you're not doing all of these things and so god is saying i love you i am using this man as an example that as he and the story is just so um enticing and i and i and, and and i speak to my brothers and sisters this morning that go ahead read it read it and and look at the love that is within i pray that god will open your spiritual eyes and spiritual ears this morning to see what he's saying in this word I, i'm telling you the word the word the word the word when you come to to, 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 to just grow in love. I'm not going to say fall in love. I know you're looking for that word. But when you come to grow in love with Christ, you will understand the word because the Holy Spirit will bring it alive in you. And I, I don't want to 
do a long video this morning but i hope you get it in those few minutes that i have already spoken i hope you get it jesus love us and you will hear me talking more and more about the love of christ my testimony and what the lord has done for me through me what you know just to help you on your journey just to help you on your journey because we are on a journey we are on a journey and we need that love we need that that backup we need we need that push we need that lift but i believe god this morning i believe god just as though this um or um hosea has returned for her harlot her harlot wife hey god this morning what a word what a word we thank god for his word this morning we thank him for his kindness we thank him this morning for what he's about to do father we give you thanks this morning for your word we give you thanks for your kindness it would take a lot more minutes to expound on your word this morning but god even for these few minutes father we pray that somebody heart will be touched this morning somebody heart will move this morning and somebody will understand your undying love oh god almighty that you have for them this morning may you breathe afresh upon them this morning in the name of jesus and lord i thank you that you shall be a lamp unto their part and a light a lamp unto their feet and a light under their part according to psalms 119 105 and so we thank you god this morning cover that person under your blood this morning and may they be lifted up and may they be strengthened in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And we said, Amen. Thank you. Thank, thank you for tuning in. And thank you to just allow the word to do a new thing in your heart. Please remember to subscribe and to and and to and to make a comment. Make a comment and like, you know, because you know how it goes. We need that support. We need that support. And we thank you for tuning in. God bless you. God continue to keep you until the next video. It is Tuesday, the 25th of the 8th month, 2020. And we thank God for being in the land of the living. Just thank God this month. Thank